Managing your research can be a daunting task, especially when dealing with multiple papers or assignments with many different resources. The library catalog has an amazing feature that can really help you in this task. It's called My Favorites, or the PIN. My Favorites is only accessible when signed into the library catalog, so the first step is to go ahead and do so. You know you are signed in when your name is in the upper right hand corner of the screen. To see how My Favorites can really help you manage your research, let's start by doing a keyword search on the topic Music Copyright in the General Library search box on the library homepage. We've gotten over 900,000 results, but that is okay. We will narrow them down and then save some individual item records to My Favorites. So let's narrow down our search to just books and ebooks. Under the Refine My Results header, use the filters under the Resource Type header to do so. Reading the abstract or a chapter or two of a book or ebook is a great way to start the research process. So let's start by saving a few of these types of item records to My Favorites. For any resource that you want to save because it looks relevant and you might want to come back to it, select the pin icon in the upper right hand side of the numbered item record to save it to your My Favorites. You will know you have saved a particular item record because the pin in that item now has a slash through it and says Remove from My Favorites. Now let's limit to just peer reviewed articles. Get rid of the books and ebooks limiters by selecting the Reset Filters link and replace them with the Peer Reviewed Journals limiter under the Availability header. Let's save a few of these to My Favorites as well. Now that we have a good number of item records saved to My Favorites, it's time to go organize them. To start with, go to My Favorites by selecting the pin icon next to your name in the upper right hand corner of the page. All the selected resources should be there, but just in a list, so let's get those a little more organized. Adding labels is the best way to organize your resources into discrete groups. Let's add the general label copyright to all the resources we just pinned. If you have a list of records that you know you want to label all the same, you can select all by using the box at the top of the list, or a group by selecting the box next to the title for each record. Then select the pencil icon next to My Favorites at the top of the page and add a label to all the selected records. The first time you add a label, you will need to type it in manually, but then after that you will see it as an option to add automatically. If you want to label just a single resource, select the pencil icon at the bottom of that individual record. All the labels being used can be found on the right side of the page under the header Labels. Select a label to see that group of records. This can really help organize your research by allowing access to the resources for a particular project or concept at a moment's notice. Also, when it comes time to create a bibliography for your project, instead of having to go back and find the record from which you can generate a citation, the record is in My Favorites and the automatic citation generator can save you time, though always remember to check it for accuracy. Finally, to remove an item record from my favorite, select the pin icon again for that particular item record or group of records. My Favorites is an amazing tool for managing your research. It's completely private. You can save any resource record while you're signed in, and only you will be able to access them. Use the label system to organize resources and return to them later. Returning to resources for further exploration is vital to comprehensive research, and My Favorites provides an efficient way to do so. If you have any questions regarding how to use my favorites or anything else, please don't hesitate to ask a librarian.